Hello everyone, welcome to IB Gaming because IB Gaming, no. <laughs> anyway, um, so we basically finished Batman Arkham Knight. Just one small thing I have to do, but I'll post that another day. So we're going to start another game called Imposter Factory. So it turns out I searched this game online and turns out it's part of the to the moon game which i've heard about and i heard it's really good but i haven't played it yet and i don't have it but it's a prequel to that story so there might be some things that might be confusing to me because i don't know the entire story yet but hopefully when i have a chance i can play the rest of the games in that series um yeah so we're going to start this today it's not that long a game it's like three to four hours um, so we'll probably have like maybe two max four playthroughs of this and then we'll figure out what we're going to play after this um so yeah let's uh get going it's very story rich so we'll see what happens Of the road. Quincy, who hosts dumb parties at a place like this. Quincy, why did I even escape accept the invitation in the first place? Well, actually. Why did I accept the invita invitation? The rusty mailbox is stuffed full. I wonder if I can interact with the puddles. It doesn't look like there's really much I can do, but go for it. Hello? Alright, they let me in. Dot 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 dot. Uh oh. Wait. This is how horror stories began, isn't it? <laughs> but maybe also some romance stories. No, mostly just horror stories. He's not wrong. A quaint stone statue of a lady and a bird. A large and mishappen overgrowth. Hapen? It might be Hapen. I don't read. <laughs> I'm actually using my controller, but I might change to using the keypad. Might be easier. This fountain. It's just overflowing from the rain. It doesn't seem like it's been used in a long time. Come to think of it, this whole place seems rather overgrown. Do people really still live here? Quaint statue laid in a bird. Sir Fluflox, do not 
enter. So we got a dog that seems to be violent. Got a nice little pond. Get interacted with it, I guess. Oh, if I go slower. I'm going to go in here. Because, look, the door's open. A drinking pool. Da, da, da. It's empty and damp. So, yeah, so Fu Fox is out. It's empty and damp. Okay. Anything else? He can run. Not knock. Da da da. What's him she? Here, let me get that for you. Rika. Oh, hello there. Hi. I was invited to the... Uh, am I even at the right place? Yes, you're the first guest to arrive, in fact. You aren't early. The other guests are just late. Uh, must be the rain. Sorry about the floor. That's fine. Just stand still for a moment. Whoa. How did you do that? That be the auto cleaning module X Clean 2000. Or was it the X Clean 3000? No, it was the X Clean 4000 Super. The owners are a bit germophobic. We spare no expense when it comes to cleanliness. Owners? So you aren't... Certainly not. <laughs> We're just their assistants. Caretakers of the house, among other things. Speaking of which, they should be expecting you upstairs. It be to your credit to greet them. They like those who are punctual. Oh, alright. It's a bit past three. This is gorgeous. Sheesh. The bathroom is to your right. Huh? To wash your hands. Gymophobe, remember? Right. But I'm curious. Feel free to mix up at home, but would you please wash your hands first? The bathroom is the first side entrance on the right. Alright, let me go do that then. This seems stickless. Sheesh, this is huge. Whoa, this seems a bit much. Do they really need to sit on gold to make a dump? Fair, fair, fair statement. I don't understand gold toilets either. It's kind of weird. A golden toilet. 
not feeling it now, but when I do, I'm going to destroy this toilet. I don't know why we would do that. The toilet did nothing to you. A crystalline bathtub. Any secrets? Don't look like it. What the heck is that? This is huge. They got a pool table. Da, da, da. Oh, what the? Oh, my. Hey, the party hasn't started yet. The main entrance is attraction is off limits till then. Sorry. The main attraction. Ought to be like a dead body or something. There are buttons on here. But activation information mark one. Okay. Uh hey. Hello. You just let me just Sir What do you do? Rice bot has two purposes. Cook best rice and emotional support. <laughs> Let's look up best rice. Are you sure you cooked the best rice? Elaborate. I mean, how do you know you really cooked the best rice? Who's to say? Rice bot says it. <laughs> but you're the cook. Rice bot is rice bot. You are only Quincy. You are not rice bot. <laughs> This is true. Why spot knows rice? It is known. Okay, okay. Sheesh. Wait, how does it know my name? Well, I suppose I could use some emotional support. How can you help? A nuanced question depends on many factors. What is troubling you? Well, I'm a bit fuzzy right now, but... I think lately I've been feeling the solution is rice. <laughs> yes, always. The solution is rice. Would you like some? <laughs> Not now, thanks. Okay. It appears there's nothing Rossbot can do for you. Entering hibernation, rice warming mode. That was pretty extra. Just a bit. A dustless billiard table. Anything else? Ah, no entrance to the same place. Let's see, let's go back here. Ooh, got some chefs. A vertical oven roasting at max capacity. Chef in blue, the secret to the best seasoning. Well, it's super fresh garlic. And the secret to the freshest garlic is to watch them grow. The secret to a clean kitchen is a good sanitary routine. And a good sanitary routine begins with the floor, one tile at a time. I'm gonna try to keep. The guests are arriving! There's not enough time! We need more chefs! Uh, may I help? No! Someone's press. Anything else? No, he just keeps yelling. That poor man. He's trying his best. The pot's a maniac. Alright, let's get out of here then. That dude's freaking me out. 
Let's talk to them. Is everything to your liking? Well, I just got here, but I'm sure it's fancy. Although, if you don't mind me asking, why is it so overgrown outside? I mean, compared to in here, it's like day and night. Ah, uh, please excuse the sight. The endless rain has halted my efforts. Or perhaps did the fox trample the foliage again? Is it an actual fox? Fox? As in an actual fox? Fox? Yes, sir, with a full set of ears and legs. Did you not see Sir Flu Flox? Flu Fox? Uh, I don't think so. Are you sure? Looks a tan like a dog, pointy ears, right in the chin, and a tip of tail. Yeah, I know what a fox looks like. I mean, my last name. Wait, was that his fencing up there? It was open. Well, hunker my bonkers. I better go check on him. Yes or no? Strange. So, uh, what's with the security measure? You should know. You signed a non-disclosure agreement, right? Non-disclosure agreement? Yep. That said, feel free to greet them upstairs. I didn't answer my question, lady. Is this what we're here for? Alright, let's go, go upstairs, I guess. Actually, let me... Um, yeah, she just wants me to go upstairs. She's like, shut up, go upstairs. It's a quaint little Dr. Haynes. Well, Linry. Oh, sorry, I zoned out for a bit. Hmm. Boop. That's my piece. Capturing my king with my own pawn. To the one move I did not anticipate. Okay, look. This chess game is cute and all, but can we cut to the chase? Are you joining us or not? Hello. Well, I see the others are arriving. Not leaving because you're losing for once. I don't lose, I get generous. Hello, my name is that's rude. Hmm. A mid-game state of a chessboard, neither clock seems to have been to have moved. Hey. Are you one of the hosts? No, I'm a guest. A guest, but what's your name? Quincy, Quincy Reynard. And you? Hmm, what's your favorite food? Uh, excuse me? Come on, Tex. Your favorite food? Got any? Uh, it's steak very rare steak are you telling the truth okay fine it's avocado salad <laughs> wait what is this just curious hey you never told me your name 
It's Linry. Linry is weird. An inviting bottle of a single malt and two glasses. Pour a glass and drink. Yes. It's not that inviting. I shouldn't drink other stuff. Drink other stuff. Oh, I guess. How are you feeling? Uh, I'm doing fine, but... Well, this place makes me a little uneasy. How so? Isn't the fire cozy? I don't know, it just feels a little off. You sure are making yourself at home, though. Have you been here before? Yeah, I've been here many times. But this is my first time. That makes no sense. I see. Wait, what? <laughs> hmm? Huh? Sorry, but can I have a moment to myself, please? I just need to take care of something. Alright. Weirdo. It's a bit past three. Oh, fire hot. Ow. Guess he burned himself. Wait, I have something to ask you. Huh? I mean, first, I have something to tell you. What is it? Your jacket looks nice. Oh, uh, thanks. And what do you want to ask me? Never mind that. Maybe I'll ask later. Hmm, okay. Then. Weirdo. A laptop with a physical lock on it. Hmm. Hmm. I gotta find me a key. Nah. I won't leave just yet. I will go here. Oh, well. This is cute. Whoa, this room's something else. A bra small bronze key, perfect. Perhaps that's for the door. Nani? Uh, I should probably get that back. Oh no. I better find a way to get that key without losing a hand. Receive thing on a stick. Here goes something on a stick. <laughs> Hmm? Is that the fox? Oh, it's a little kitty! Oh, it's so cute! Okay. Receive door key. A fish shaped plush toy. Empty bowl. That door over there should lead back to the hallway. Okay. A left door. <gasps> oh no! H hey! Oh no! 
It's the doctor. It's Dr. Hanley and Dr. Hugh. You. What? You better get out of there. Nenri. Oh, she's gone. And the fire's out. Help! Someone help! Honey, you got blood all over you now. Hey, what happened? We heard you yell. What is that on your hand? It, it wasn't me, though. It wasn't me. I gotta, I gotta tell them. But what did I even see? Wait a second, I need to tell them. Okay, is something the matter? U upstairs, S something happened. What do you mean? Th they're dead. I saw, I don't know how, but I, I mean, I just opened the door and, have they arrived? Hmm. Oh good, you're here. Welcome and please make yourself at home. What the pug? Wait, maybe I'm just seeing things. Maybe they aren't really here, really there. Not kiddo, they're there. Shoot, they're still super alive. I mean, no, wait, that, that's a good thing. Maybe I just, I imagine the bodies? But how did I? I didn't even know what they looked like. Are you doing all right? It looked like you were spacing out there. Is something the matter? Is your blood sugar low, dear? I, no, I'm fine. I mean, I don't know what I... It's about time. You two'd better go and get ready. It's Linry. Linry. Hello. Did you see what happened? What? Ha I'm sorry. Do I know you? Do. Do you not remember me? Have we met somewhere? Here! We literally met here! I mean, not literally literally here, but uh, in this house. What are you even talking about? I just got here. But upstairs, you asked me what my favorite food was and my dark secret. Okay, you're starting to freak me out. Wait a minute. Do you happen to have a twin? Please do not harass the guests, other guests, Mr. Bernard. Oh, what grisly skies we have out there. 
tell me you have something to take care of the mess, dear? Why not, Miss Ayuja? Just step onto the auto cleaning module and all will be sorted. Auto cleaning? Whatever happened to the more hands on approach? You seem like a capable lad for one. Goodness, so many guests. Gosh, I'm such a mess. And you think I got into this gown just to drip mud all over the floor? We not, ma'am. It's nothing our ex clean 4000 super can't handle. 4000? A generation behind, aren't we? I just want the better for a facility of this nature. Duly noted, Mr. Armstrong. Oh, your cheeks are just so cute when you say that. Goodness, so many voices. <laughs> Boy, it's raining terabytes out there. Darn, is that the egg clean 4000 super ass by? Impeccable cats, Mr. Clegg. Of course, I've been wanting to take one of these apart. <laughs> Along with what you've been brewing over there, if the rooms are true. Certainly, we'll try not to disappoint. Oh, thank goodness. Hopefully that's the last people. <laughs> Let's see if I can remember all these voices. <laughs> Goodness, so many people. Who are all these people? Well, it's time to mingle. Um, excuse me. Oh, it's you again. Again? So remember. No, please leave me alone. As I was saying lately, and I think you will find this most interesting. Oh, yes, of course. What were we talking about again? So, because underneath the refrigerator is the second most common place to find ice? Okay. But you see, Lenry, my team revolutionized the industry. I'm sorry, which industry are we talking about? Of course, excuse me. My mind shoots ahead on its own sometimes. This is the eternal curse of the genius. I must ever be slowing down. Alright. They should be ready soon. Please be patient. And yeah, okay. I'm glad to see my brother so willing to spend money for rats. Why just yesterday he took one he took one look at my cute ruby encrusted shoe horn and said Sister, I didn't slay my life away with hard work and hearing your father's fortune just to spend it all. I dare say your joint funds are serving humanity better than they would have they've done at home. I think I wrote that right. Move. Scusa. Darling, if what lies in that room of in that other room is even half of what we're promised. Well, I don't suppose you, I don't suppose you much care for the technical details, do you? Oh, I care. I indeed I do. This gadget stuff has always been a dear passion. If only if I only had the time, of course. <laughs> I mean, how else would my multi-pan mirror work? Man, man, I need some fresh air. Care for a tuna roll? I'm not in the mood for a, I mean, am I going crazy? No, sir, these rolls really do smell this good. I mean, back upstairs, I'm pretty sure I just saw. But it, just then, they were standing there Sir, I don't know what you're talking about, but it sounds like you could really use a tuna roll. <laughs> you know what? Fine. Give it to me. Yummy. Okay, that does help. <laughs> I know. Please excuse my forgetting of the different voices I have right now. There's so many people. <laughs> 
who was this guy? I think it was like, I was told there would be an inevitable stream of money flowing here. But looking around, Adina and I must make up 80% of the net worth in this room. Well, someone's cocky. Let's see, I won't go upstairs again. I want to see if... Just what is even happening here? Am I going crazy? Or maybe it's just deja vu combined with a bad dream? Yeah, I must have slept too late last night and dozed off in the bathroom. Linry! Oh no, it's you again. Sorry, I just wanted to... Look, I just want to go to the bathroom. If you don't stop this... Oh. If you don't stop this... This... Hold on. Do you smell something? Yeah, is that... Smoke. Uh-oh. Smoke! Uh, I should help. <gasps> oh no! A vertical oven at max capacity. I'm gonna turn it off. It's too late. They're already here. Need an extra pair of hands? No, just save yourselves. <laughs> this poor chef, he is losing it. Start these other guys. What do, uh, I forgot his voice. Ah, oh, shoot. What do he sound like? I think it was like some type of country something. What do I have over the as clean four thousand? You ask. One word. Patience. Um, with that long lines at the supermarket, I'm actually saving time and freshness. More chefs. More chefs. We need more chefs. Like, dude, we're literally willing to help. But yeah, I think that's what was, what was, see, the stove. Pots of mania, but it's not. Let me turn it off. Let me talk to her. What's going on here? I don't even know. I mean, I don't really see anything else like really interact with. I turned off the thing. I talked to the people. I don't see anything burning. I guess I'll leave. This whole freaking house is just... What the fudge? Oh, uh, was that? Goes back in there, but, 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 but she's... Yeah, honey, you lose your mind. Let me check in here just one more time. Um... Hey, were you just... Hmm? Oh, so, never mind. So... Thus far, I see that there are two leaneries. You know what? I didn't go this way last time. Let me go up here.
Henry? It's quiet. Door's locked. Door's locked. There was a small opening at the bottom. It's locked again? That's true. I unlocked it earlier. It happened again. How could this be happening again? Maybe, maybe I really am just seeing things after all. Yeah, those these hallucinations are really getting out of hand. Oh no. Oh, Mr. Menard, have you met the professors already? You can say that. Uh, yeah, I think they're in there. Great, thanks. Oh no. Please be hallucination, please be hallucination. Shoot. Ugh. Oh no. I need to get to the bottom of this. Oh my gosh, what have I got myself into? The one time we attend a sketchy and secluded party without our party guides. Ugh, where their eyes are still open. And that smell, I just can't take it anymore. Wait, wait. Oh God, oh man, it's finally happening. It's finally happened. My cooking killed someone. Did he even eat the meal yet? No. What does it matter anymore? Well... So, Chef thinks he's done it. Well, I'll, we'll be okay, right? The FBI has to be on their way. And they bring SWAT and PETA. -E they bring everything. I'll be frank if you ask me. I say, well, you guests did it. Unless, of course, one of us took this very chance to make it appear as if so and said. I mean, if I was to commit this heinous crime, this is exactly how I would go about it. Wait, wait a minute. Did I do it? I picked the perfect words for that dude. <laughs> wait a second, I gotta drink water. There's a lot of reading. Okay. Oh no, this is terrible. Culinary school did not prepare me for this. This is true. Ambulance, yes, but I don't think they're breathing. What's that, fire trucks? Well, bring everyone. Um, yes, fire trucks too, please. Yes, I know it's remote, but please hurry. You know what's strange? If only four people live here, why do they need three chefs? This isn't the time for jokes. What were you doing upstairs earlier? That wasn't a joke. What do you mean? I saw you come upstairs earlier, right before I found the bodies. But I never came upstairs. I was in the kitchen. Well, yeah, okay, I saw that too. You aren't making so much sense. I'm not. I know. Look, we all need to calm down. There's a lot to take in. The bloodstained body pierced stuff. Miss Ayuta, please stay back and keep a safe distance. Oh please, dear. I done my. I I've seen my fair share of corpses back in the day. But you know what's odd? I never seen rooms like these. And their eyes is as if they were seeing something ter horrible. Hmm. These aren't bullet rooms, nor are they knife rooms. 
please step back, Miss Ayuja. We don't know if the bodies are dangerous. Oh, quit your yabbing. It's not like I'm touching them. Mm-hmm. It's something. Okay. Let me see if I can find Adina. Where did she go? I come over here now. The window seemed to block the light from inside. Huh, I thought I left the key in the door earlier. How am I supposed to get this blast of cat? Where did the lady go? Wait, where are you going? Uh, I'm just wandering. Actually, when I came up and saw this, you were the only other person here. Uh-oh. Is that true, Mr. Renard? What were you doing here? Hey, now, I was just, uh, wandering. Wait, actually, no, I followed her. Linry, after leaving the kitchen, I followed her upstairs and. Excuse me, but the lady stayed in the kitchen with us. Yeah, we came up together just now. Why are you lying, Mr. Renard? Is there something you'd like to tell us? I'm not lying. She went upstairs too. I swear I saw it. Maybe you should have a seat, Mr. Renard. I don't think you should be go you should be going anywhere. No, I, I can't explain. Just let me exp I think I can. Oh, there he goes. Uh-oh. <laughs> Why am I running? I've done nothing wrong. I guess I want to. I better hold it in. Earlier, when I was washed, when I washed my hands, it says he think that, but I knew it. I knew it. Yeah. Hmm. The knocking. It stopped. The door is unlocked. H Hello? Is 
Linry again. Is that statue different? Hmm. It's just like before. Did I really do it? Did I reset time? Seems like it. I'm gonna go upstairs. She went in the party room. All right, they won't let me. Doors locked. And everyone's fine. Do they not, do they all not remember? This should be ready soon. Please be patient. Dr. Yoon is a certifiable genius, just a bit longer. How much longer will they keep us waiting? You're anxious as well. Mostly just bored. I was told there would be an invaluable stream of money flowing here. But looking around, I need to make up 90% of the net worth now. Instead of 80. To truly comprehend the gravitas of the feet, we need to go back to basic physics. Oh, must we? Hey, Linry? Oh, it's you again. Can I help you? Yeah, I just have a question. Do you find it strange that they have so many chefs in here? So many chefs? I don't know. How many do they even have? As I was saying, Linry, and I think you will find this extremely intriguing. Oh, yes, of course. What were we talking about again? So because of most because most cat hair is discarded in common waste bins. She really doesn't remember. Or maybe she's just pretending. Care for a tuna roll? No, that's fine. The rice and tuna roll is made by rice bot. Oh, neat. Did you eat it? Yeah, it was good, thanks. Just good? They are to die for. Okay, the way you put it, that is troubling given the circumstances. <sighs> the main attraction. So they don't remember. Okay, I can figure this out. I just gotta think. I just, oh my goodness, really? Oh shoot. Okay, maybe I can't figure this out. Where's Linry? I'm just gonna ask, gonna go ask her outright. Disappointment brought you here as well. Disappointment? I mean, what's happened in the next gym jogger and all, but it's a shame that I may disrupt what seemed like a fan fascinating start. A fascinating start. You mean, you know what that thing is? Not the details, but the briefing at the NDA sign, I'm surely. Wait. Have you not signed the NDA? NDA? Non-disclosure agreement. I'll take that as a no. Well, I can't say much, but here's a hint. This thing messes with your noggin. Hmm. I don't understand. What could have been the motive? I mean, sure, they were indeed germophobic, but this is too much. What's going to happen to them? What's going to happen to me? In 
more importantly, what's going to happen to my garlic? I, I can't believe this. Thought to you, thought to Haynes, we could have done this. And as I walked through the door, that's when it happened. The fine fabric of my trousers were caught by the handle and its delicate line of the pot. Oh, and I saw the bodies. Horrible. Did you notice anything off when you first saw the bodies? Yes, indeed I did. They were dead. Thanks, Victor. So helpful. Yeah, and then I would wipe off the fingerprints and all the evidence that ties it to myself. Theoretically. Theoretically. Okay, but do you see anything that would help with this actual case? What? This is helping? Oh wait, this is helping. Were you giving direct theories from me, a theoretical criminal mastermind? Oh, you're giving direct theories from me, a theoretical criminal mastermind. Sir, I think I'm going to need your name ID. <laughs> Oh, pull yourself together, lad. What kind of train chef has embraced through a murder or two? Door's locked. Is someone in there? Stay away. This is my hiding spot. Ugh, this could be a problem. But I guess I should go find Lynn Ray first some anyway, anyhow. with the cat. Hey, what are you doing out here? This whole time, you could come, you could come and go on all on your own accord. Wait a minute. Could it be? Dude. Oh my god. <laughs> no. No, it couldn't be. That's just dumb. <laughs> hey, where'd it go? Door's locked. Huh? That's new. It's unlocked. Mm. Oh my gosh, it's real. Why is that cat so long? Excuse me? Wait, no, that's not what I came here to ask. You know what? I was gonna straight up and say it. There are two of you. That's right, I saw it. You were at two places at once. Also, I think that sink downstairs freaking resets time. I don't wanna say Groundhog Day, but there's something bonkers going on. You're aware how crazy you sound, right? Oh, trust me. I know. I mean, am I crazy? Maybe. But is this crazy? Definitely. I don't know what you expect me to say. Just answer me this. Do you have any clue what I'm talking about? Not at all. Aha! You're lying. Why do you think that? 
Well, let's see. There are two bed dead bodies downstairs. You're alone, and a stranger approaches, approaches with crazy tales. If you aren't in on all of this, then why are you not running? And where would I run to? I don't know. Somewhere away from me? Look, to be honest, you are freaking me out. But it's more in a strange way than, well, I don't know, but I just don't think you're the killer or anything. How do you know that? You don't know me. <laughs> and given the circumstances, even I would think I would, could be the killer. I'm not sure. It's just a feeling. There's something about you. I just feel that you can't be the killer. Okay, I know that's supposed to be good, but why does it feel a bit emasculating? Well, why are you running? From what? From me. Why, uh, why would I be running from you? I mean, a mysterious stranger appearing double in a time resetting murder loop? If what you're saying is true, then it sounds like I would be the suspicious one. Uh, can't argue with you there. But I guess that there's something about you too. I mean, this is so crazy that I feel like I'm still in denial, but there's something about you that makes me feel that like you can't be the killer either. Take me to it. What? The sink downstairs. You said it resets time. You believe me? No, don't be ridiculous. But, given the circumstances, let us see what's making you act this way. <sighs> Alright, I guess that's the best I could hope for. Come on, I'll show you. What if you go in there? Oh yeah, it's locked. Oh yeah, there's one problem. Stay away! Let me try. Hey, are you right in there? Go away, I'm not letting anyone in until my bodyguards get here. That's fine, I'm leaving. Could you just knock on the door every five minutes or so though? What? Why? Just so we know you're alive, of course. I mean, you're all alone in there. If something happens, nobody would know. And who knows that there are other entrances, those singled out are easy targets after all. In fact, this murder podcast I was just listening to the other day said, There she goes. There. Why do you listen to the murder podcasts? It's complicated. to do it I'm gonna do it um actually wait what you can't wash your hands with someone watching no it's just do you mind if we do it together why I mean maybe that way there's more of a chance we'd both travel in time I don't really know how sync related time travel works, but I'm just tired of being the only crazy person every time I come out of this bathroom. This better not be some convoluted scheme to try something weird with me. Don't flatter yourself. There are corpses outside and, not, and I'm not in the mood. Well, come on. Wait. 
What? Just in case this doesn't work. Can you tell me a secret so it's easier to convince you that we've met before? You're sounding more and more sketchy by the minute. I know. <sighs> lavender. Huh? Just lavender. Okay. Wait. <laughs> what? You said you met you met me in these other supposed timelines? Yeah, I thought you didn't believe this. I don't, but never mind. Look, I'm just curious. What did I say to you? Well, we didn't really talk much, but Oh, you did say there was something that you wanted to ask me and show me. That was the first time I saw you, I think. Hmm. Any idea? Not a clue. Okay, let's get this over with. Right. Third time's charm. Wait. What? <laughs> Never mind. I forgot what I was going to say. My goodness. Okay, let's do this. Is something supposed to happen? I don't know. I guess maybe it already happened. For the last few minutes, I just turn on the water and wash my hands like this. And close my eyes like this. Then I opened my eyes and walked outside. And she's gone. Len Lenry? <laughs> hey. Shoot. It's been reset again. I guess I'm the only one who can use the sink after all. At least it's easy to talk to Larry now. They should still be at the party room. No. Oh shoot, it's empty. H Hello? That light is so bright. Where's it coming from? Is there a light fixture on there? Hmm. Oh, everyone's gone. Them too. I think I'm gonna stop if I can figure out how to save. Because my throat. <laughs> It's safe. All right, let's go a little bit longer than now. Oh my goodness. What the heck is going on? What? What is happening? I don't understand. What is this?
There's so many bodies. What is this feeling? Oh, yo. Door's locked. Sorry. My microphone keeps falling. The door won't open. Was that the door? Door's locked. Hmm. Oh, now we can go through. What is going on? Door is locked. They're quite literally everywhere. What time is it? It's 326, so time's still continuing. Back to the bathroom, I guess. Whoa. What is happening to me? What is hap what is happening to me? <laughs> Even just one of you was enough trouble as it was. What? What? What the pug? Hey, hey wait! She just left, like, mm -mm, screw this. <laughs> What the fudge? Hey. Linry. What what is what's going on? I'm sorry. This was going to be about you, but then this happened. I write more inter iterations, but I can't stop it. It keeps on happening and it shouldn't. What? You can't just leave like that. Please, tell me what's going on. That's actually what I've been trying to figure out myself. Seems like you weren't, res you weren't reset like the rest, though. 
I guess that's one more thing to fix. Reset. But this is good. Maybe you can show me what you saw. What I saw. Well, it all started when I went into the washroom earlier and then. Oh, wow. Well. Hmm. You've seen some weird stuff. That might come in handy. What the pug was that? Funny coincidence, though. That really did make the sink sing like a time machine. But the chances that my resets lined up per so perfectly with sync. Improbable. Are you even talking to me? What? Wait a minute. Am I a robot? Sorry. As I said, I'm just a bit preoccupied right now. But basically, I can create this world and I created you. Well, I created this world and I created you. What? What? <laughs> his little hands over his face. It's so cute. So my throat. <laughs> I've been talking a lot. I think I'm gonna stop now. I'm gonna make sure that I save. Right when. Yeah, I guess that's the one. Just in case. Alright, there we go. So, yeah, that is Imposter Factory right now. I like it. I'm having so much fun. I should play more games like this where I have to voice act because it's really fun. Only it does a lot to the throat. So, um, things are getting crazy. We might finish it in the next playthrough, but we shall see. So, until next time, um, I'll catch you on the next video. Bye bye.